all we have are concepts, a few sketches here and there. So we really are gonna have to get a whole survey of the land. There's a big water feature because it is low lock. So we need to manage that water and work with MSD to do that. But the idea here would be that we have bigger groups of animals rather than a whole slew of different species. I've seen hummingbirds back here and catbirds and we saw a flicker a couple days ago. So uh, this is gonna be a real special project. Yeah. We can't thank you enough for all that you did to make it possible. So. We had a chance to visit the 20 undeveloped acres that will become Kentucky Trails. It's part of the zoo's master plan since 2016, and it's been on our radar. But with the help of the General Assembly and the mayor's office, we're able now to move the project further than we would have any other way. I'm from far eastern Kentucky, so I see not the wildlife that has come from other areas, but a red-tailed hawk that's sitting here. They fly over my house, but you don't see that often in Louisville, in Jefferson County. It allows the city and the country to bridge each other's kind of spectrums and spheres of influence. I've driven through this state, west to east, east to west. It really is a thing of beauty when you see the elk in the pasture. And so I'm just excited that everybody is going to get to experience that right here in Louisville, Kentucky. It's a great botanical center. It's a great conservation center. It just reminds us of the beautiful world that we live in that we got to focus on keeping beautiful and sustainable each and every day and the zoo does that for us. More people can come from around the world to see what the full state of Kentucky looks like so we're very grateful for that. The opportunity to celebrate wildlife, especially such a rich wildlife heritage of Kentucky, is really exciting and this will be a very natural looking area, a very natural feeling area and an opportunity for people to really immerse themselves and the chance to drive through in a safari type vehicle with elk and bison as well.